and welcome to another episode of Miriam Dead Librarian Reviews. In this episode, we're going to be talking about some recent books that just came out by some famous athletes, particularly basketball. We have books by Dwayne Wade. He came out with a nice book about his life lessons. Chris Bosch, we have a book about the NBA. Steve Kerr, we even have a new book about Kobe, the legendary Kobe Bryant from the Los Angeles Lakers. So if you're interested in learning about more of these books that we have at the library, stick around. The first book we're gonna talk about is by Dwayne Wade. It's called Dwayne. So this book is amazing. It has wonderful personal photography pictures from his personal collection. It talks about the life lessons he learned from high school all the way to becoming one of the NBA championships. It also goes through his personal life, how he met his wife, his children, what he does off camera. He's actually a fashion designer and he likes to dabble a little bit in music. This book by Dwayne Wayne was really fascinating. If you can see, there's lots of great pictures. This is one of the pictures he has of him and his wife getting married. And we have other pictures here of him and some other legendary basketball stars. So what I particularly liked about this book, it's not very wordy and it has lots of illustrations. And it takes you through his life of um, championships, doing his charity work, and you just feel like you're with him. Here's another beautiful picture of his family. Now this book, Dwayne Wade, just came out. It was really popular and we have a lot of books like this in the library as well. So if you wanna come to the library and check this one out, feel free. Also, don't forget that when you come to the library, you can ask about any other sports as well. We have many books on different sports and athletes that wrote books about them. So for my next book, it's called The Rise, Kobe Bryant, Pursuit of Immorality. Now we all know that Kobe passed away in January of 2020, and that was a very sad year for the world. But this book actually immortalizes Kobe Bryant and his amazing journey through life and being in Philadelphia. This is what the book says. This is more than a basketball book. This is an exploration of identity and a making of an icon and the effect of his development on those around him, the essence of the man before he truly became a man. So if you are interested in early Kobe Bryant, his high school years, what made him one of the greatest legends in the Los Angeles Lakers, if not of all basketball, I would recommend this book, Kobe Bryant Pursuit of Immorality, The Rise. Also, as a little bonus, they have tons of pictures. In here, we have a section of pictures, and it talks about how he went through high school and how he was so amazing, and he was building his skills at that level already, trying to be the best that he can be and what he would do to do that, and the trials and tribulations he went through to get to that point. So this book is really great if you're a real fan of Kobe or you just want to know what pushes the athletes from day to day, I would recommend this book, available at the Riverside Public Library. So the next book I'm going to talk about is called Steve Kerr, A Life. This one is by Scott Howard Coper. This book is about Steve Kerr, one of the most famous basketball coach in basketball history. He's led one NBA team to five championships. It talks about his life as a child, he was overseas with his parents, how he got into basketball and his college basketball history. Also, it talks about his coaching styles and how he got into coaching and how he became one of the lead coaches for the Golden State Warriors, one of the greatest basketball teams in California and the country. Steve Kerr is a very insightful read. It also has illustrations and pictures from his own personal collection so it could take you through his journey of life and what he has learned as a coach that makes him one of the best coaches around. This is Steve Kerr by Scott Howard Cooper. Again, available at your Riverside Public Library. So my next books are going to be a few books, two about basketball and one about baseball. The first one is called Stars of the NBA. This is a juvenile nonfiction book, but I really wanted to highlight this one in the video because it's new and it talks about the stars of the NBA, like Bra Brown, Kyrie Irving, and all the different teams, such as Harden from the Houston Rockets. The Stars of the NBA is a really good book if you want to just have a brief little introduction of the different stars that are popular in the NBA today. The next book is called Comeback Season. 
The comeback season is a likely story of friendship with the greatest living Negro League baseball players. So this is a very historical book. This talks about the Negro League when it was in the Major League Baseball and the history of what it started. So this book I highly recommend. It was very insightful and it talked a lot about the history and what they had to go through, especially in the South when starting the league. It is by Cam Perrin and Nick Childs. Once again, it's called Come Back Season. And the final book I wanted to highlight is called Chris Bosch, Letters to a Young Athlete. Chris Bosch was also an NBA athlete, and he wanted to pass along his knowledge to any young athletes out there. It talks about how what he had to go through to become one of the best athletes in basketball. It is very interesting. It talks about his life, his family, and how they molded him to be become one of the best basketball players. So if you're interested, or if you're a young athlete, or if you know any young athletes, I would recommend this book by Chris Bosch, Letters to Young Athlete. And they could get a lot of good pointers if they're just starting out in their career or just want to improve in their life. Thank you so much for joining me in this episode of Miriam the Librarian Reviews. Once again, I want to emphasize we have tons of more content on our online systems, our cloud library, which I'm going to add up here. And also, if you want to check out Hoopla, I could add that up here. If you want to look at sports movies, sports documentaries, or read more books on sports, head on over because they will have so much content for you to read. And some of these books are on cloud library. Also, don't forget to like our videos, subscribe, and turn those notifications on so then whenever the City of Riverside Public Library YouTube comes around, you'll be the first one to know on our YouTube channel. Thank you so much for joining us, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye, everybody.